In today's episode, we will see the terrifying attacks of the leopard and their prey. These are the horrible moments when the gorilla and leopard fight to protect their cubs. The massive gorillas attacking the leaders to protect themselves. When doing it properly, this will grant them the mate, food, and a chance to pass on the gene to the next generation. Gorillas often hunt and gather in gangs, raiding each other's territories and leaving bloody corpses. They are also known to threaten and attack humans in their natural habitat. This might come about because of deforestation, arid land, causing the gorillas to live in tighter and tighter environments. It is a threat to them and their natural world. And for some prey, it is making it easier to spot them out in the forest. Running with your cubs across the yard, the mother leopard is in full attack mode. She is ready to protect her young at all costs. Yet observing for a while, she realizes that this gorilla is not an easy target. Now she must take her cubs elsewhere, hunting for a new day. The appearance of the leopard has scared the chimps. Quickly waiting for a moment to flee, the orangutan's arms can reach up to two meters in length. Muscular and strong, their hand-shaped feet allow them to hold onto branches swinging above the treetops. With incredibly flexible limbs, wrists, and hips, they can accommodate all types of movements in the treetops. It is thanks to this spectacular advantage that they have the ability to operate quickly, no other species able to compare. Targeting the baboon, the clouded leopard quickly climbs up the tree for his prey. Seeing the leopard approach, the baboon must find a new hiding place. The monkeys below scurrying sending out a signal of danger. Master hunting skills, the leopard soon defeats the baboons, climbing to the top of the branches. But unable to reach the very end of the tree, he is forced to lay beneath the tree, waiting for the baboon to lower itself. The others surround and attack the leopard who has fallen, but still yet he is the master, able to capture the baboon, receiving a fatal bite in the jugular. Although baboons can be cunning and they know how to take revenge on the young cubs, quickly stealing the prey's young and fleeing to a new ground. This is an expensive lesson learned by the leopard. The wrong opponent was chosen today. Baboons and leopards are two sworn enemies. Often between them, there is fierce battles for territory. Here they may even lose their life. But these unlucky cubs were caught by the baboon when the mother was out hunting. Knowing that the main enemy is over nearby, the leopard immediately attends to take revenge. Realizing her young is in danger, she spots the baboon in the tree, deciding to attack and kill. It is the enemy's intentions to get to the top of the tree branch. Catch the baby monkey and the leopard will have a new meal. This is not a matter of hunger. 
but he must climb to high depths and take a serious fall before he captures the baby monkey. Witnessing the scenes unfold, the mother monkey grows extremely upset, angered, ready to attack back at the leopard. Possessing spectacular speed, the mother monkey is destined to chase the leopard. Now, she cannot save her child from the death sentence, but she can take revenge. The herd of lions are out hunting, wandering in the fields. The naughty baboons have caught their attention. Ready to split up an ambush, the lioness has led the way. Seeing the lions come closer, the baboons retreat to the tree branches. It is only at the top of the branches that they have safety. Here, where the lions cannot reach them because of their weight and size. Despite all, the lions attempt. They are destined to stay at the thicker branches as the monkeys are able to toil with them, playing from branch to branch. It is their best survival skills. The only way out is down. And this is what the lion relies upon. Once safe upon ground, the lion successfully captures the baby monkey. Baboons have been attacked by the lion for countless years. It is a long-standing rivalry. However, the lion does not immediately kill this prey, but instead they play a game of cat and mouse. The lion is here only to injure the baboon, enough to keep the victim from running and to continue playing with his toy. Once more they run to the treetops, but the lion is not as agile and the baboon cannot be compared with strength. However, distracted by the baboon high above, it is a constant challenge for the lord of the jungle. Lions are not initially good climbers, but still they try with their might. Once on the ground, this is the territory of the lion. Surely a winning fight. Exhausted and out of energy, the two have not yet attacked fiercely. The lion seems to be intimidated by the ferocity of the baboon. Perhaps it is a pack animal and the lion knows it cannot prevail. Ostriches and cheetahs are both animals with the fastest running speed in the world. However, in addition to speed, cheetahs have the advantage of extreme dexterity. This is how they are able to dominate and hunt for ostriches alike. A herd of hungry cheetahs is watching the giant bird in the background. Ready to make their move, they are scouting their next meal. Suddenly increasing their speed, the cheetah quickly approaches the bird, waiting to threaten and terrorize it. Rushing in forward, the ostrich, as one of the fastest birds in the world, quickly runs in panic from its enemy. Not before enlarging its wings, showing its dominance and power. It only takes a few seconds until the herd is willing to fight alongside the cheetah. Now, as a pack, they can run in together, inching closer to the ostrich and their next meal. But taken by surprise, the ostrich has its own herd. It is a flock of three. Now this is a fair fight. Hoping to escape, the ostrich picks up speed on the gravel road. But finally, 
the fierce attack from the cheetahs is taken underway. They take out one ostrich and devour it whole. A herd of wild buffaloes rests on the grass. A lion hunting in the savanna, pacing back and forth, observing its surrounding. The lion begins to speed up, running towards its prey. The mother and daughter of the wild buffalo have not yet discovered the lion. The lion come to attack. The young runs behind its mother, and the mother stood to confront the lions. They join forces to attack. One bites the neck, one bites the hip, and the weak young buffalo could only stand by. During that time, another buffalo is chased and resists. They run away from the lion and they are afraid of the horns of the big buffalo. By the river, another confrontation of buffalo and lion. They are fighting fiercely with each other. The lion is hunting in the savanna. Under the shallow lake, the hyena has gone for a drink. He is walking on the grass, looking around. The hyenas get to eat their prey together as a herd. The lion is hunting next to the herd of hyenas. While they share their food, taking portions and separating a place to enjoy. The lion is in the distance, keeping an eye on them. Next on the field, the lions begin to share a large buffalo. The hyenas wish to approach, but they are chased away. The lions devour their prey. A lioness goes hunting to attack the group of hyenas. The hyenas are a herd animal and they rely on their strength. They do not hesitate to attack the lion and they take turns. The large lion is running fiercely, attacked by a pack of hyenas. Under the large tree, the mother buffalo is taking care of her young. Hungry lions are waiting. Hiding behind the lawn, they carefully watch their every move. The mother buffalo is taking care of her young. The lions turn their gaze upon them. The lion quickly runs, crouching towards its prey. At the riverbank, another lion was confronting the large buffalo. He chases the buffalo on the vast prairie. The large herd of buffalo joining forces to attack. The confrontation between buffalo and lion never stops on the steppe. The buffaloes have discovered their fellow mate. They come to protect. On the trail, the young buffalo is being attacked. Mother Buffalo must come quick to protect her young. In the forest, another young buffalo is being attacked by the lion and the fellows quickly come to chase away the lion. The hyenas are looking for the lion's prey. The lion digs upon the grass, deeper. The hyenas notice the lion digging for food. After a while, the lion finally pulls up what looks like a wild boar. The little lion drags the wild boar out of the den to enjoy. He kills the prey quickly by biting its neck. The boar struggles against the lion's bite. While the lion was taking down the pig, a hyena approaches and rushes in. The lion bit the neck of the hyena and the hip of the pig. He has discovered that the prey was being watched and he's chased away the hyenas immediately. The pig is quickly defeated. 
the lion must now bring back the prey to a safe position to enjoy. Lions begin to hunt on the prairie grass. Two baby cubs are laying side by side, looking at their mother. Amongst the field, the buffaloes are facing each other, using their horns against the lion. The mother buffalo chases away the lion for safety of her young. The lion approaches the young buffalo and has caught it, biting the neck and dragging it by the calves. The young buffalo is freed by his mother as she comes to ram the lion. On the open ground, the two lions are attacking the mother buffalo next to the baby. In the forest, they join forces to attack. They chase and jump on the lion. Near the riverbank, the buffaloes must join together to chase away the lion that is disturbing the herd. Today's video is coming to an end and thank you for your attention. If you love videos about fighting animals, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the latest content. Thanks again and we'll see you in the next video.